Like and subscribe right now for amazing luck for the next week. Make sure to watch today's full video to see an optical illusion where you must watch if your name has the letter A in it. And not just that, but comment down below your answers to the optical illusions down below in the comment section as we go along. Right now on our screen, it just looks like we have an ordinary camel, right? Well, wrong. Within this camel, there is actually a hidden face. If you're able to find the face, comment down below, I found the face. But this one is very tricky, so good luck. Okay, you guys, so when we actually flip this camel upside down, you'll come to realize that there is actually a man's face that is right here. Were you able to see this, or was it too hard? Comment below if you were able to see the face. Only 1% of people are actually able to read what the word is that is in between these purple and white lines. Comment down below what word you're able to see. Only 1% of people can read this, so good luck. So, are you a part of one of the 1%? If so, comment down below what the word you saw was. And the word that I see is the word Fortnite. Did you see the same one? Are you also a part of that 1%? What is wrong within this image? A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. The calmer you are, the easier it is to find. Huh? I see nothing wrong here. Do you guys see anything wrong? Comment below what you find. Okay, you guys, so what's actually wrong with this image is the word find is spelt wrong. It's F-I-N-D when they spelt it F-N-I-D. Did you see this or was it too hard to find? This right here is a colorblind test. Let's figure out, are you colorblind? So on our screen right now, we have a blue area here. Within this area is actually a number. Are you able to see what that number is? If you can't see a number right now, it is official. You are 100% colorblind. You should probably actually go talk to a doctor or something because I don't know. If you can't see the number, that's crazy. But if you can see the number, comment down below what number you're able to see. So the number that's actually shown on the screen is the number 20. Now that I changed the actual colors of the background, you'll now be able to see that a lot easier, even if you are colorblind. Can you see it now? Check out this. It looks like a lot of bunch of just different lines and graphs. It almost looks like a chart that would be for stocks or something. So comment down below if you are able to see something inside of here. Hint, it is a word. Try to figure out what that word is and comment down below what that word is. Okay, you guys, so the word that's actually hidden within here is the word museum. Were you able to see this one or was it just too hard? Right now we have uh, animals on our screen, but how many animals are there? And what animals are though? Comment down below what animals you see inside this image. And then I'll actually go and reveal every single animal hidden in this image. So you guys, we have a grizzly bear, a butterfly, a snail, a polar bear, a cow, an elephant, a bird, a giraffe, a duck, a rabbit, a cat, a cat, a wolf, and that's actually all of them. Did you find all of those? Personally, I didn't really see the snail. Can you find the animal that's hidden in this image? It is a big animal, so look deep and you should be able to find it. When you find the animal, comment down below what animal you actually found. So you guys, the animal actually hidden in this image is a giraffe, and it's right here. Were you able to see it, or was that too difficult? This is really weird, because it looks like all the seeds are actually spinning, but whichever seed you look at begins to stop spinning. You look at a seed, it's spinning, you look at it, it stops spinning. You look away, it's spinning, you look away, it stops spinning. Take your finger and place it on the seed. You'll come to realize that none of the seeds are moving at all. I really don't know how this one works, but that is freaky. Is this considered an any or an Audi? Is the smallest point of this black and white illusion pointing in, or is it pointing out? Comment down below which one you think. This one is honestly anyone's guess, so we can actually go and compare our answers in the comment section below. So guess which way. Do you think the inner's most point is pointing in, or pointing out? Comment below. This is crazy, you guys. When you first look at this, you'll actually see a few diamonds in this picture that are popping out. But look closer. There's not actually a single line that actually creates a diamond, which is so weird to think. I really don't know how this one exists. The contrast between the black and white actually just makes our brain assume that they exist. And, uh, well, it's actually gonna figure out that there is no lines to make the diamond, nor are they popping out. 
I really don't know what's happening here. I, I'm confused. Someone please explain this one, because I'm going to start getting wrinkles on my forehead if we keep... I, I'm lost. This one's messed my brain up. This image right here appears to be spinning, right? Well, it actually supposedly isn't spinning. Do you see it spinning? If you do, go down below in the comment section right now and comment, I see it spinning, because this is trippy. These squares on the left look like it's actually super wacky, right? But in reality, these squares are not weird at all. If we take a look at this image, you'll come to realize that these squares are perfectly perfect. But in reality, once we put it back on the other image and it's all those squiggly black and white lines, it creates an illusion effect that makes it look like the squares are weird. Did you think this was weird? Did you think those squares were perfect? Or do you think they're a little bit wonky? Personally, I thought they were wonky. Whoa, take a look at this. It almost looks like a 3D image kind of popping out of like a checkers board. This is very interesting. But you guys, if you actually didn't know this, every single square here is actually 100% straight. All of them, even the ones in the middle. The placement of the miniature squares within the squares warps the lines and makes them appear to look curved. But in reality, they aren't curved at all. How can adding a few little more squares make an image appear curved? That's creepy. That's impossible. Whoa, take a look at these illusions. Whichever way that arrow is pointing, it appears it is actually moving in that direction. But the color is just shifting. Nothing here is moving at all, you guys. Keep that in mind. Those Pac-Man are not moving. Just the color is being changed, which is changing our mind and vision. Creepy how that works, right? On our screen right now is a very, very, very famous picture. Do you know what that picture is, though? Comment down below what the picture is. If you get this right, you are a genius because only 0.0001% of people can actually see the image. Can you? Comment down below what you see. Okay, you guys, so the image that's actually on the screen right now is an image of the Mona Lisa. If you couldn't see that, then what you should do is go farther away from your device and you might be able to see it. Or take your eyes, squint them, and then you might be able to see it a little bit better as well. Were you able to see the Mona Lisa though? Let me know in the comments down below. Yes, guys, you need to watch this video if your name has the letter A in it. So, does your name have the letter A in it? If it does, then let's go! You are here just on time. But if your name doesn't have the letter A, what are you doing here? You should be banished. But, thankfully, I'll find out if that's true or not. Because right now, I need you to go down below the comment section and actually comment what your name is. So, does your name have the letter A in it? Let me know by commenting below. Well, there you have it, you guys. If you enjoyed today's video, go down below and hit that subscribe button. And also hit the like button and tap on another video you see on the screen right now to watch more videos just like this one. And I'll see you over in that video.